Hello parents, I am Bhuvneshwari Raman, a K-12 educator and been in this domain for 35 years. This video has been made with the intention to help parents with a few activities that they could do at home with the children so that the learning is not stopped. With schools shut, parents are wondering how the learning curve can be continued and keep them gainfully engaged. A few things that you as parents could do is to play games like Pictionary. It brings out the creative angle in the child. Play games like Scrabble, which brings out a lot of new words, vocabulary develops in this process. Play games like Monopoly, where a lot of money transaction is involved and children explore such possibilities of adding or subtracting mentally. Similarly, there is a new product in the market which I came across called the Gamified Flashcards. So these are lovely flashcards and they've been aligned with the curriculum. So the learning is something which is aligned to your child's curriculum and also it's equally engaging. It goes something like this. I have something which is for grade three, which I picked up from the market. So this is by Luma World. So they have different cards like this, wherein the questions are given, say what, which digit is in the tens place and a particular number is given. So the grade three child actually goes through it and says, yes, maybe I think one is in the tens place, but not very sure. So she or he turns the card around and they actually see that it is scrambled in this particular piece of puzzle. And the answer is something that is visible only through a magic lens, which the child places and gets the answer says, yes, I'm right. So these cards are actually numbered in increasing order of difficulty starting from 1 to 40. And these are concept based cards. So once the child finishes this, in terms of you can play it in multiple ways where the child picks up a card, finds the answer, gets a point. The parent picks up a card, finds the answer and if it is right, gets a point. Similarly, the sibling does. So you could have it like a family game or you could have it like a in one minute, how many cards are you able to answer? And the next person does it for the next minute and you could even shuffle the cards and play it around. Similarly, they also have something which is called, these are the concept based cards and these are the application based cards. There are 40 of them here. Again, everything is color coded in this particular way so that it's an increasing order of difficulty and the answers are hidden where the magic lens is the one which will reveal the answers. These are the other cards, which are application-based cards, a little higher in terms of more challenging. So a very interesting tool. And what I realize is they are actually giving a lot of giveaways in terms of absolutely free. So I would suggest that you can actually explore going to their website and find out more details. This is from Luma World. I shall continue and have many more videos to come to suggest more such tools, games and activities that you could do with your children. Take care and stay safe.